hello and uh, welcome back to the channel i am harish and in this channel i talk about uh, apps and softwares and web based tools that uh, help you create uh, products prototypes or even solutions uh, without any coding and uh, in this video i'm going to talk about uh, one quick way to import data from any third party rest api I've uh, already made a video where uh, a little bit of coding uh, is required where you copy a snippet from uh, GitHub and paste it in Google Apps Script and all of that. But uh, in this one, I'm going to show you a much faster way to um, pull data from a third party API with absolutely zero coding in this one. You're not going to copy any code absolutely at all. So yeah, let's get into it. So the first step is uh, to open this tool from uh, the website called spread simple so the url for the tool is going to be spreadsimple.com slash tool slash import json and what this tool helps you do is uh, it will give you the formula for the cell that you are going to use in google sheet to import the data so as you see as you can see it asks for the json url and it will give you a formula that you can copy and uh, paste in the google sheet and it also helps you uh, preview the data before you actually copy and paste it in the google sheet right so um, let's see how this works uh, the first api that we're going to do is uh, going to be this one where you get a summary for each country and the number of cases in that country with the ongoing pandemic so let's uh, i'm just going to paste this and uh, say preview data let's see what happens first and then let us look at uh, pulling data right so as you can see the data is pulled into multiple columns and uh, if you can notice there is message global countries right let's focus on getting just the country's data into different columns and rows so that we have uh, countries list along with the data against each country so the the thing that we need here is to specify the json path that you want to copy from here right so the json path for this is going to be uh, if you want to understand what path and how to use uh, the formula to get the right path in the json uh, you can click on the jsonpath.com and for this specific example i'm going to write it to you and show so uh, as you can see the default is uh, dollar dot value so we are not going to touch the dollar and dot since it is used to get the full result right so i'm going to do i'm going to replace this value with uh, countries and leave the rest let's see what happens and uh, after this let's say let's add a dot to get all the countries values right so let's preview the data and voila we got it right so all the country's data is fetched now what this next step is very simple uh, i'm just going to copy the google sheet formula as you can see here open a google sheet and see if this works in the google sheet we'll also try this with another api and let's see if this works first so yeah you can uh, create any new sub sheet in this and use this or i'm just going to do it for the first cell itself to make this easier so yeah uh, in the first cell all we have to do is uh, paste the formula that we just copied once this loads uh, i'm going to do that yes so now if i paste the formula and say enter it's going to take a second to load and uh, yep we have the data now uh, you have pretty much the liberty to do anything you want with this data you, if you want to create a graph go ahead and create a graph you want to create a mobile application using this and glide apps you can do that uh, let's let's also try this with uh, another api i'm going to use a interesting and new api this time which is a, a subreddit api so there is this uh, subreddit called uh, astrophotography let me just quickly open that the api for this uh, is going to be very simple but what we're going to do is uh, get the latest posts and the images so images are all urls and they're really beautiful images right so what we're going to do is uh, to convert this reddit subreddit into a api all you have to do is in the url just say new.json to get the new ones and uh, sort is equal to new 
and that gives you a json response json is the data type as you are probably aware by now of uh, what the response is and in this response as you can see uh, the image url is uh, here in the url overridden by uh, dst key and uh, also in the url key right so if i open this it will open up yes this is the hd image right this is the high high definition image of the post itself so if you want to create like a wallpaper based app or if you just want to create a gallery based mobile application you can do that uh, using the subreddit api right so now we are going to copy this and go back to the same tool and paste it here now now we need to add the right path to to get the value right so if you go back to this you can see that uh, the values are hidden in data and inside that they are inside children uh, array so data is the object children is the array and inside that then there is again a data object and inside this is the data that we really need right so to fetch this specific object what we are going to do is uh, first remember that it is inside data and then children and then data right so i'm just going to do a dollar dot data and uh, dot children of course and since children is the array what we're going to do is similar to last time where we did countries now i'm going to add uh, the colon which specifies that i have to get everything inside the array right and then dot data now let's see what happens let me just quickly click preview and we should have all the columns inside the data object right so there is subreddit self text title uh, if you scroll to the right all of these are filled up right so so yeah we have all the columns and uh, api url is also here yes so looks like this works so i'm going to just take this into the google sheet and see if it works here and it's just pasted in the first column i just copied the url from the tool and uh, within a second we should have the data yes uh, everything works and i'm just going to look for the url so this is the thumbnail url and then there should be the two columns where the url is yes this is the first one where it says url overridden by underscore dest destination and uh, then there is the url field itself so this is the high res Im image so if i click on this it loads a high res image of that specific reddit post right so this is uh, how you import json data from any api uh, you can use uh, instagram api you can use spotify api to create playlists customized uh, for yourself in a google sheet or you can use uh, wordpress api to get the woocommerce data into a google sheet you can pretty much do anything with any api and by just uh, understanding how the json path works you can learn it here on jsonpath.com and using this simple tool uh, that is that will help you convert uh, an api into a formula so that you can fetch anything into a google sheet directly uh, with that i uh, hope you've learned something from quick from this video and i hope this is much faster and easier compared to the last one and uh, yeah if you if you want to learn more tools like this and use more apis like this please subscribe to the channel and also drop a like uh, to this video so that i can make more videos like this and explore more tools and uh, make more tutorials that may probably help you get started with whatever you want to build and uh, yeah that's it for this one thank you